Hi guys, today I'm going to do a How I Style Dungarees video. I've wanted dungarees for so long, I've been watching them on eBay for months and months and months but it's taken me ages to actually get a pair. So I got these ones and I absolutely love them, I can't even explain how much I love them, I just want to wear them 24-7. They're so cool and they're just really fun compared to a lot of other types of clothing. Some people might think they're absolutely disgusting and why on earth would you want to wear them? But I personally love them and I hope you like them too. Obviously because dungarees are a big item, they cover a lot of your body, these looks aren't going to be vastly different but I'm going to show you a few ways I style them. This is the first outfit I have and it's really casual. I've just gone for a white crop top from Topshop, a big chunky belt which is my Levi's belt which I got from a boot fair and my plain and simple converse. Because dungarees are so big and boxy it's really important to cinch it in with a belt. I've added the crop top to bring back a bit of femininity so that you can see that tiny little bit of skin there when you're wearing it up but also you've got the arms and it's not just completely covered and completely boxy and manly. For a jacket I've gone for this cropped black studded jacket and I've had this for absolutely years. Because it's cropped you keep the femininity and you still get to see the belt so you still get to see the waist. It doesn't completely swamp you. It also works because we're working with black with the belt and the shoes. This is the second look and what I've done here is I've rolled the trousers right up and I'm wearing red as the staple colour and I'm using gold as the metal colour. This mirror belt is from Topshop and I got it for Christmas. These shoes are also from Topshop which I got in the sale. The bowler hat is from H&M and I think it just adds that extra bit of cool to this outfit. I'm then also wearing this deep red racer back crop top from H&M. You can't actually see that it's crop top because it's slightly tucked into the top of the trousers but it is a crop top and it's from H&M. Also with the dungarees I'm only wearing one side up, I've got the other side hanging down. That's just another thing you can do with dungarees, they're so versatile you can do so much with them. They're really a brilliant piece to have. For a coat I've gone for this leather jacket with a fur collar. I got this for Christmas from my nana and granddad and I love it. It's ever so slightly too big for me but it's brilliant and you can just put it over anything. I think it also adds another bit of cool and a bit of edge because leather jackets are just really cool. This is the last look I have to show you and what I've done is I've layered this grey kickers sweater over the top of this checked shirt which has a leather collar that's just poking through the top. The sweatshirt was from a charity shop and this shirt is from Urban Outfitters. Then I'm wearing this big chunky belt which my mum gave me so it's vintage. And then I am wearing my creepers which I absolutely love. I got these from office in the sale so they might still be there. For socks I'm wearing some cream frilly socks which I got from eBay, I'll link the listing below if I can find it. This is a really chunky outfit with this big sweatshirt and these really baggy trousers so it's not the most feminine thing ever but it's really comfy and it would be brilliant for just lazing around the house. That's it, I hope you liked it, I hope you got some ideas if you have dungarees yourself and are thinking of ways to style them. Remember you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram, you can also comment, like the video if you liked it and subscribe. I love you guys loads. Thanks for watching. Bye!